since he could walk. Darcy. No doubt his father, David, himself a former league player in two states, will be very interested to see his son playing today. Leon Cameron has it on the outer wing. Well, Leon Cameron, he's virtually a new recruit after injuries in the last season and a half. Cook! James Cook the mark, 48 metres out. And they're not suffering from finals nerves, are they? They've been very adventurous early in this part of the game with their kicking, their field kicking. It's the number one short kicking side, the Western Bulldogs, up against the number one long kicking side in the competition, the Adelaide Crows. A real contrast of styles. What a comeback by James Cook. He kicked five goals in five games last year. This year he's kicked 30, 11 in his last two games. So he's on fire in front of the sticks and even a 50 metre distance shouldn't bother James Cook. Start of a final. Might have some effect. Looks good. What a goal! First goal of the game. Stopped and came back and sat on the bench. That's here for the Bulldogs. McLeod. The Crows have certainly lifted and at the moment they lead by seven points. Sampson towards the centre of the ground. Mark West. West on the run. Long kick is a beauty. Cook. Hello who only came on the ground to replace Romero, has already had a couple of touches. Peter McKenna. He's got to run out and have a snap on the right. He's got it. Great call, Pete. The Bulldogs within a point. High tackle paid there. Greg Scroop obviously uh, saw something after he called for what appeared to be a ball up. To be taken by Liberatore. Floating punt kick up towards the half forward line. The flyer was Darcy and he's got time to recover. In fact, he has paid the advantage because he got a push. He kicks up the wall, Henry takes the mark. Directly in front, 30 metres out. Well, Darcy's starting to worry Hart just with his sheer height. Hart's probably giving away a number of centimetres. And unless he can get the actual jump on Darcy, then Darcy's just going to put those long arms up into the air. And with Hart's lack of height, he may give away free kicks like that. So Cook for his third and his 33rd for the season. Uh, the Bulldog fans love it. They hit back. And hit back hard. Nearly siren time. So a big chance here for the Bulldogs. Out in front, Hudson. That's a great grab. He dropped an easy one in the first quarter. Kept the eyes on the ball on that occasion. Kicks the ball wide. He's looking for Cook. He's got him. The siren sounds. James Cook has booted three. One goal in the first term. Two so far in this second quarter. And when he was drafted in 1990, David Parkin said that Carlton picked him up because he had Royce Hart-like qualities. Well, he'll need him with the pressure. To have a shot after the siren. Going for goal number four, James Cook. Distance shouldn't be a worry, usually a thumping kick. Starting to bend back, it's bending back! He's got it! Cook's kick four! Sensational finish for the Bulldogs! Great way to go in at half-time. Under pressure, Smith thought he had it, lost it from Cox. Working back, Cox comes again, goes short. The Bulldogs now, Cameron goes to ground. It's fierce and ferocious at the G in the centre of the ground. West comes through, goes back to the half forward line, out in front. He's got it. The captain. Cook. He's booted four goals, including one after the siren at half time, and he's been reported. 100%. Four kicks, four goals. To uh, make Darcy pay for doing the ruck work against him. So Cook rams it through. Just efficiency at its best by James Cook. 
But the way the Western Bulldogs worked the ball forward there, they changed direction. They went from one side of the ground to the other, just looking for space. And once again, it was the running of West. And that's his 21st possession for the game. So the Adelaide side are really going to have to just slow him down this second half. Keating does well, or Scotty West runs into Costas. Smith tries to get clear. Jarman applies a solid tackle. Ball spills free to Mark West. West looks up towards the right half forward area, and Grant is there. Chris Grant's still a long way out. The doggies have got a bit of a sniff. He looks towards Darcy and Co. Oh, at the back. He's going to kick another one again. If you can, say the doggies. Play. Jamison. Siren. Closer in the grand final. Oh, look at them. They've gone mad at Football Park. And the players. Well, look at Liver. Bubba Smith cannot believe it. There's been so much written and so much said. But the reality is the dogs have missed out.